Now, uh, uh, up in Scarborough is a CP yard, and they bring the cars in and they put them in a big parking lot. I don't know how they get them out. Now, what I did, I used sandpaper, and I'm using the cars to uh, uh, hold the sandpaper in place. And you'll notice in the back, the uh, auto loader, they're not the scale, but it uh, gives me a place to put my cars. Now, uh, where I live is the lake, and then there is a railroad track, and then there is a road, and they close the road off, the lake shore, uh, to allow for immigration. So I'm going to show you some of my track in just a minute. Okay, in the summer I can hear the uh, Indy racing uh, down by the lake, and they have to close our summer the road, and that's why it's so expensive. So uh, it makes a good layout. I got the buildings from Walmart. This just shows you the road, uh, and they have to close it for the Indy. So it, this will give you some ideas. Now here, I could, I, uh, where I used to live is Buttonville Airport. Now someone's going to ask me why I got a screen there. He says, well, here in the middle, uh, I do my photography and video, so I have a little keyboard. You can see that under uh, macro photography. Anyways, I hope this will give you some ideas how to uh, make your diecast cars look good.